Okay, so today we're just going to briefly talk about browser notifications. You'll go into Home, you'll hit Browser Notifications. Um, remember, you'll have to customize your back office if you don't have it on your home page, so you can add it there. So um, you can create a campaign, but let's just edit it. I've done one already, and you'll see. Basically, what you want to do is um, name it, right? The URL that will go to the redirect after you subscribe all right so they're going to subscribe and then where do you want to send them well they came on your website to begin with so you'd like them to stay on your website right unless you want them to go somewhere else and then you would just add that url pop-up size i definitely like the big one um basically the title of the text you know hit desktop no notifications or just notifications is fine um and then what's the invite sign up for training get my dinner recipes, um, get lunch specials, get my latest training, get my recent video, um, latest product launches, whatever you want to place here. It's all up to you. Do an image, upload an image, enable load notifications, and then um, decline label. And then you can, you know, the, the button colors, okay. And then this is the picture that I uploaded, and that's what it will look like. Desktop notifications, sign up for training notifications, enable notifications. So all of this can be changed. You hit done. Right? And then let's go see what that looks like. This is my website that I placed it on. Now I'll start to scroll and it'll just pop up. Now remember, image can be changed, notifications can be changed, sign up, all of this can be changed. This is a great way to have a subscriber list, right? This is not necessarily like signing, just giving your email. This is truly just browser notifications. So some people don't like to, right? They don't open up all the emails, but when you're on your desktop, they also have a business app that you can create too. It's a great way to keep in touch with your customers and push out notifications so that they know what's going on with your business. All right, so think outside the box. Think of ways that you can use these notifications to tell people what's going on. And you've seen them before, right? If you're on Facebook, you get those, you know, coming onto the right, so-and-so gave you a message or um, reply, or whatever it is. You see the notifications coming in usually on the right side of your screen. So that's it for today. I hope this is helpful. And think of ways that, you know, you could use this browser notification for your business.